Welcome, friends. Today, we are doing another unboxing video. Tremendous. That's right, friends. Today, I am back with another unboxing video, and it is quite an exciting one. Um... For I have received not just the fragrance I ordered, but many, many free goodies. So that's exciting. As you can probably tell from the title, this is from the brand of MDCI. So, I will give you a little context around how I have come to be in possession of this fragrance. I... I have always been aware of MDCI, people talking about the brand, saying it's absolutely excellent. Obviously, everybody's, I mean, I say obviously, but, you know, a lot of people in the community, if you've been in, in the community for any sort of length of time, you're aware of stuff like Sheep Palatan and Invasion Bar Bar. Um, but they have lots of other fragrances as well. Um, and I have tried... A few over the years and none of them ever clicked um i've got i have got first impressions on a couple of samples uh, i think they were amber top cappy and queer garamante that was a while that was about a year ago um, but recently I was looking to get some samples from the house of Grossmith, Grossmith. Um, and so I went to Javois, that's where they sell them. And when I was at Javois, I was thinking, are there any other samples here I would like to try? And I found a couple from MDCI. I tried one of them and it really did just click like bang and i was like wow that's incredible i can't believe i never i never saw it before you know took it to my friend's house she was in total agreement she thought it was incredible um and so i bought it i wanted to buy it and decided to buy it and so i went around looking for the best deal i could possibly find um and I was speaking to different people and eventually I ended up speaking to Fliss from Les Odorants who told me if you order straight from the brand in France, they will include five 11, 11 mil uh, like travel atomizers and some samples. So you get like extra goodies for your money. And I thought, ah, I like the sound of that. Excuse me whilst I hydrate. <clears throat> so I got went to the brand the website and the website's not ideal the website's not great I won't lie to you on the website you are urged to contact the brand via email and discuss um, the terms of said purchase so I got in touch with the brand and sort of the, I, I, I was like oh Hello, I would like to buy this fragrance. Um, I understand that you send um, 11 mil atomizers of which you can choose which ones you want, which perfumes you want in the 11 mil atomizers. And they got back in touch and they said, yes, you can. You also get three uh, two milliliter samples as well of your choice. And you can have a travel atomizer too. And I was like, wow, thanks very much. So... If you are looking to buy an MDCI perfume, go to the website, buy directly from them, and you will get many extra goodies, of which I will now reveal to you. So, first thing, you get the choice between a black and a gold travel atomizer. Look, there it is. Parfums MDCI travel atomizer. Look. It's just your standard travel atomizer, really. Um, there you are. Little screw top. Um, I was never buying a gold one, so I got the black one instead. It's quite nice. It's functional. It's 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 not going to change your world. It hasn't really got much weight in it, but then it hasn't got a lot of perfume in it either. So, well, it hasn't got any perfume in it. What am I talking about? So, that's nice. 
um, out for now, you know, I'll take anything for nothing. So that was the um, travel atomizer. Next up, they said they included three two mil samples, but in my possession, in my uh, packet, I got six. So double bubble. Here they are, there's Queer Garamante, which I think I asked for, Ambra Top Cappy, La Surprise, Queer Cavalier, uh, Blue Satan, and Enlevima Osorel, which uh, Fliss recommended to me. So that's good. Next up, we have what I assume is the travel atomizer. So let's get this sorted there we are it has a little seal on it not a not a not a flappy seal that claps this little thing here there's not one on the back though or maybe that's the front who knows up you come i should really do this before the video starts shouldn't i oh well there we go and there they are. Oh, how weird. Spoiled it. Oh, right. So the ones I chose were Le Elegant, Invasion Barbar, Queer Cavalier, La Homogon, and Chypre Palatan. These are all 11 mil in a very nice presentation, and I just, of which I am determined to destroy. Uh, I all of these are falling out, apparently. No, all of these I am excited to try. There will be a first impressions on the house from these, and there will also be a first impressions on the samples that I got as well. So, maybe there will be more purchases from the brand, who knows? Now, on to the fragrance that I bought, the main, the main meal. The meat and potatoes, as Rob says. Here we go. This is how the perfume comes. I chose, you do get to choose. It comes like this. Oops. It comes like this. Uh, you do get to choose which bottle and which presentation you would like. Excuse me whilst I hydrate. Now, I decided to go for the Silk Road presentation. I would really like one with the um, the little uh, porcelain figurine on the top. I think that's cool. Um, but it's an extra 150 euros or something silly like that. And I thought, I'm not paying that for a fucking porcelain figurine. I'm not a millionaire. Like, I can get a, another good perfume with that. You know? That's a lot of... It's a lot of wedge for a cap. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? Uh, but here we are. So, the fragrance I have decided to get from the brand is Invasion Barbar. So, Invasion Barbar means barbaric invasion. Not like Barbar Black Sheep, not Invasion of the Sheep. Um, or Invasion of the Barbers, which some people believe. It's got a little M, M there. And the seals are on this still. I shall try and part those without destroying them, which I have managed to do. Fantastic. So, here we go. Here is, it's got a little tassel, don't fall out. I got the Silk Road bottle. That is going to fall out, isn't it? There we have it, my friends. I will take it out of the box. Oops. Parfums MDCI, says the little sticker on the back. Flacon Prechaud. This is the Silk Road presentation. You can get the, this is a hundred mil, but you can get the um, 75 ml, a bit cheaper. But I thought I would rather just pay the extra. You know what I mean? I'd rather pay the extra and just get this bottle. It's fucking gorgeous. 
It really is very, very nice. Um, I prefer a round bottle or a rounded bottle, I must admit, but this just looks absolutely fantastic, does it not? You know? So I think this is going to go into the spring and summer re present air uh, rotation, so there's no need to keep the box open. It will not be being used again. Oh, you can smell the ink off the, box, off the box, though. That's not nice. But there we are. Okay, so. Invasion Bar Bar. I will spray it. Here is your tassel. How nice is that? That is absolutely gorgeous presentation. Um, it doesn't have the name of the fragrance on the front or the back of the bottle. It does have it on the sticker underneath though. Imagine if you got them wrong. God. Anyway, this is apparently, how do you come off? Do you unscrew? No, you pop off. And that is apparently the front. There you are, there's the sprayer. There's the tassel. The, the lid has got a little bit of weight to it, which is nice. And now I will... The sprayer has been primed. So I can only imagine that's done on purpose. I certainly hope it is. Whoa. That is immense. Lavender, violet leaf. A little bit of grapefruit at the top, but not a bad grapefruit. Um, the notes, according to Frey Grantiger, are bergamot, violet leaf, grapefruit, ginger, cardamom. Yeah, I get a bit of cardamom, actually. Thyme, lavender, vanilla, musk, and patchouli. It's absolutely stunning. This is a really like a dress up fragrance, you know, if you're going somewhere special. Um, I look forward to spending some time with this and seeing how I feel about it. I mean, I already know how I feel about it, but if I get to learn, if I get to like find out and learn more about it, then I will be able to give a more informed opinion and may even review it at some point. I realize I haven't been I haven't been great at that recently. It does remind me a little bit of Sartorial by Penhaligans and a little bit of Mar Liberté. It's got that lavender, lavender, vanilla, warm, amber, fougere thing going on. It's gorgeous. The violet leaf gives it a little bit of kick as well, you know? Um, so yes. This has been my first, imp well, not my first impressions. This has been my unboxing video for Invasion Bar Bar in the Silk Road bottle. Gorgeous. About 240 euros, I think it was, which it's not much more than a shitty fragrance like Sauvage, considering the price to quality ratio, you know? So anyway... Thank you very much for watching, everyone. I hope to see you again soon. Bye.